Austria is facing a repeat of its closest election since before World War II. Its High Court has cancelled the results of April's presidential poll just a week before the winner was due to be sworn in. An investigation revealed several centres began tallying postal votes earlier than legally allowed. The election will be between Green Party candidate Alexander van der Bellen and Norbert Hofer of the Anti-Immigration Freedom Party, who lost the election by just 31,000 votes. Tanje Male explains what this upset means for the Austrian politics. The Austrian Constitutional Court today counted a call for new elections due to, um, not due to manipulations, but due to too early processed votes, which means the votes were counted Sunday evening instead of Monday. Um, there is no indications for election fraud. It's just basically a formality. And that's why we are heading toward ballots again in October or in late September. There will be three parliamentary people who will fix the presidential post till then. And this will be Norbert Hofer. And this will be also like uh, one uh, lady from the Socialist Party and another guy from the Conservatives. So it will be three people instead of one till October. The problem is that we faced a very, very sinister election campaign in the last weeks in April and May. And um, the country is somehow divided. And the problem is that it will be even more divided during the next upcoming two or three months till the next election. Um, there is the immigration skepticism. And on the one hand, there's the very highly educated people. On the other hand, there's cities versus countryside, stuff like that.